Welcome. Welcome to Words with po Words to Ponder. This section I'm going to do Sila. See you in a minute. The verse I picked it from is the verse I did for my June Currently page. And it's Psalm 60 verse 4 and it says, Thou hast given a banner to them that fear thee, that it may be displayed because of the truth. Selah. And I thought that would be a perfect word to focus on for this words to ponder. Selah is 71 times in Psalms. It's found a couple other places, but I'm focusing on Psalms right now. And Psalms are poems or hymns. And some suggest it was a pause. So think of it this way. God's word is coming down the pages and then you see Selah. So you think, okay, this is something important. I need to pa pause on it ponder on it, meditate on it, and think on it. So I got my Bible out to the page, and I'm going to read the first uh, four verses and Psalms on what he wants us to ponder on. O God, thou hast cast us off, hast, thou hast shat, scattered us, thou hast been displeased. O oh, turn thyself to us again. Thou hast made the earth to tremble. Thou hast broken it. Heal the branch breaches thereof. For it shaketh. Thou hast shewed thy people hard things. Thou hast made us to drink the wine of astonishment. Thou hast given a banner to them that fear thee, the, the, fear thee, sorry, tongue twisted, that it may be displayed because of the truth, sila. So, God was displeased with the people there. And he did some things to awaken them. And to those who fear him, He's given them a banner to fly above them. And I thought this was something we should ponder on today. There is a lot in life right now that's upsetting. And I feel God is out there trying to wake us up and say, Hey, pay attention. Fly your banner above you. Show others about me show others that I am love and light and truth and not to listen to the lies of the world so I thought that was a wonderful thing for me to pause on and ponder on and my little thought was Let's pause and reflect on the Lord. Well, that's it for this time. I hope you enjoyed. See us next time. Bye-bye.